我这边也看一下、啊、直播，好，现在我们的直播已经上线了。好、okay, ，各位，有看到画面吗？哎、欸，我这边看不到画面。对有，有看到画面吗？各位，有听到声音吗？我们先测试一下麦克风，一二三，一二三，听得到吗？听得到吗？有哈，有画面哈。有人说是从庞德老师那边看到我，然后直接直播。接着来看啊，太感谢了，谢谢阿牛，谢谢。那我们今天这个直播这个议题，目前应该是在台湾非常非常热门的，很多人看到新的第四代福特 Focus 推出了，但是对这台车有满满的疑问，甚至看完我们快要三十分钟的试驾影片之后呢，哎，还是有好多疑问没有办法解惑。那今天呢，没有关系。今天邀请到了福特的总工程师，尤其是他是负责底盘的，来帮大家解答。所以今天你只要有任何的问题，直接在下面留言，我就会帮你转达给他们，他就会回答你想要知道的答案，好吗？好，请大家开始发问。目前我们线上的朋友有九十七人，哎，等一下就会慢慢增加了啊、哦。对。好，阿布还是请你们先自我介绍一下吧。OK， 呃，大家好，呃，我是福特六核产品开发处长徐世谦。那在我右边的，我请他自己自我，我先说一下，他是 g i m a t o n 他是我们福特欧洲来的，呃，主要是做底盘调教的一个经理 ，Vehicle Dynamic Manager。Do you want to explain yourself? Yeah, so、uh, my name is Kimato. I'm a vehicle dynamics manager at Ford of Europe, and I'm、uh, responsible for all C car applications. So also the、uh, new Ford Focus、uh, we developed、uh, in Europe. 我补充一下，他刚刚除了呃，他他是负责底盘调教以外，他他们他跟他的团队是负责所有福特 C car 的底盘调教，当然包含这一次的第四代的 All New Focus. 对。好，现在线上已经快要三百人了，在这边也提醒大家一下，如果你有什么想要知道的，直接在下面发问，然后我会帮你把问题转达出来，之后呢，你就会得到你想要的答案。好，那如果没有问题的话也没有关系，我直接跟大家讲一些你们想要知道的。有一些人，我列举几个网友比较常常发问，或者是他们认为的事情，呃，有一些网友。甚至我看到哈，有一些发言，甚至我可能自己也会这么以为，就是这一台车是我们国产的的身份，那是不是这些设定、这些配备都是由台湾福特自己决定的，甚至用上什么的悬吊，是这样吗？还是由呃国外的福特来统一决定呢 ？OK， 呃、uh, ，The question is this vehicle is Taiwan local built vehicle. So the question is choosing this、uh, torsion beam. The decision is made. I Only in, by Taiwanese team, or this is a joint decision by the global team. Consider everything.、Um, this is a joint、uh, decision. So、uh, obviously, the the platform development is、uh, being done in Europe, and there are some、uh, platform targets to be reached, like for example the weight target and uh, uh, the driving dynamics、uh, targets. So the platform has to be capable. And then, secondly, there's、uh, the market uh, team, uh, which uh, helps to choose uh, the uh, different variants, uh, which are、um, the best ones、uh, for their markets. This this platform, the initial decision is the whole Ford together, to consider and make a joint decision. That this platform's design is. 呃，主导是在福特德国，但是考虑不只是呃悬吊的稳定性、超价的稳定性，另外我们还有不一样的目标要达成，比如说车子的重量，我们要达到更好的油耗。那当然我们也知道这个市场客户的需求，所以基于所有的考量下，我们选择最好、最平衡、最适合这个当地消费者需要的一个底盘。OK， 好，看到这边大家有没有什么留言？哎，那边有留言吗？我这边都没有留言跳出来。<笑>我这边都没有留言跳出来。我刚刚问的大致上是，嗯，大部分的人会比较有的问题哦。现在有三百九十个人，好，各位不好意思，我现在留言已经跳出来了，我会一个一个的帮大家把这个留言转过去。有人说帽梯哪里买？哦，拜托不要闹了，人家那么远来，那么远来，你问人家帽梯哪里买好不好？这个圈 R B B 好，好，来哈。这个问题要来啊，请问高速急刹的时候
，不会翘屁股失控吗？这个是来自吴家阳先生的问题。Well, the question is on， 你知道用这个扭力量系统是吗？对对对。Okay. By using this torsion bin system， at for example at a high speed emergent brake condition， is the vehicle going to lose control？ No， it isn't。So um, um。Any any suspension uh, we have uh, uh, to to pass every tests uh, and and uh, including stability testing. So uh, and I was uh, personally part of that. So we did uh, stability testing uh, uh, fully laden the vehicle uh, up to top speed uh, and we even do uh, uh, roof load uh, emergency maneuvers. And so the uh, vehicle has to meet uh, uh, our uh, high standards and uh, you will not lose uh, the vehicle uh, in in those uh, conditions. 哦，不会的，他他自己亲自参与了这整个的测试，包含呃车子开到极速，然后紧急刹车，哦、呃，这都必须要满足我们原来对这个车辆稳定性的要求，就直接回答这单不会，不会失控。好，那来自边上民，边上民这位朋友问说，为何这一次要使用扭力梁？为什么不用独立悬吊 ？OK， the question is why do we choose torsion beam this time, not the SLA system? Well, um, um... We had uh, very uh, so the industry trend uh, goes towards lighter vehicles and more fuel uh, economy. So every uh, area uh, within the vehicle, so the body structure, but also the suspension, has to um, uh, play a role into lighter weight. So that was one request. The second request for focus was that we uh, would be able to deliver a uh, the fun to drive, which the Focus One has introduced in, into the segment, and. Um, We uh, had just uh, recently launched a uh, Fiesta ST, which is a performance car, uh, with a uh, not a normal twist beam, but with a twist beam with extra technology, uh, which is Ford patented and which uh, uh, really delivers both. So it's a lightweight construction, and at the same time, is very good for driving dynamics. And the proof for that is that uh, with this car, we are winning really awards uh, uh, for driving dynamics uh, uh, in in his segment, performance cars. So that's the reason why uh, we think uh, this twist beam, and it's not just a normal twist beam; it's uh, yeah, kind of uh, a, a modified or heavily modified uh, twist beam, is working uh, perfectly well into this car. Okay. Um, 当初我们选定这个扭力梁系统，其实，呃，主要的考虑，当然除了我们一直以来福特的 focus， 呃，最强调就是呃驾驶乐趣。那这个驾驶乐趣的 DNA 我们要延续，并且要做得更好。那另外一块，我们有也有接到一个不一样的任务，就是车子要做轻量化，要做让让油耗变得更好。所以 twist beam 跟车身的重量都是很大的贡献。那另外一个是在这个 Focus 发表之前，我们其实，在 Fiesta 的 ST 其实已经率先采用这个 Twist Beam 的系统。我们发现这个 Twist Beam 系统可以保持原来我们福特的驾驶乐趣的 DNA， 那也可以做到车子轻量化。那基于这些考量，我们最后决定在这个他们的 Focus 上也也采取这个扭力梁的设计。OK。好，接下来来自台北的一位廖先生啊、哦，他想请问，这个工程师是在哪里任职？是谁设计出这种东西的 ？He's asking where are you working and who designed this twist beam system? Well, it's a joint effort. So um, the engineering team uh, is uh, which we call the chassis team. They design this uh, 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 hardware. Uh, is based in Germany, so it's a uh, kind of engineered in Germany. Uh, I myself, uh, together with uh, half of the dynamics team, I'm working in uh, Belgium at Lommel Proving Ground. And why a proving ground? Obviously, we have to drive a lot, so that's why we work on the proving ground. And so uh, we together, so we from uh, the uh, driving dynamics team, we uh, define uh, the targets uh, for the twist beam or for any suspension. And uh, the chassis colleagues in Germany, they help us to uh, produce a part that delivers uh, that performance. 这个其实是一个共同团队开发出来的成果，但这个零件本身的开发是在福特德国。那这位 Guy m a t o n 他的工作地点是在比利时 l o m o Proving Ground， 他是所谓的 Vehicle Dynamic， 就是我们福特就是他的工作就是设定我整个呃超价的的的属性目标。那比如说他们觉得哦哪里，比如说车身。好像不太稳定，他们要反馈给这个德国的设计团队，说：“哎、欸，你要改哪里，达到我对这个车子设计属性的目标。” OK， 好，接下来有一位刘大同先生，他说：“他能不能了解一下这一套扭力梁系统跟 PSA 
是不是有关系 ？PSA 集团哦，以及我一直想知道这一套系统连接车身的轴心为何跟扭力梁有一个很明显的夹角，它的用意在哪里 ？OK， he, he、uh, this question is try to know、uh, any difference between the twist beam and the PSA system， and he saw that there is a 啊啊扭力梁跟哪里车身的轴心啊？对。呃，他是讲哪里的轴心？那扭力梁这个，这个，这个吧，这个有个夹角是吗对对对 ？OK， he's saying there there is an angle. If you this is、yes. a vertical the direction to the vehicle, and here there's an angle.、Yeah. What's the purpose of the angle? Well,、um, <coughs> there are different applications of the twist beam. Indeed, there's some、uh, with straight、uh, bushes, as we call them, and with angled bushes. Yeah, we always prefer the angled bushes because that design inherently,、uh, if you corner. Uh, introduces some、uh, what we call roll understeer in, into、uh, the vehicle. So that means you have a kind of a stabilizing effect from the bush because it's angled uh, under uh, under cornering、uh, conditions. So the、uh, straight bush would not have that, and you would have to take other countermeasures to、uh, to improve that. 我们福特的设计有很多种，有比如说这个地方跟车身是垂直没有角度的，那这个是我们叫做有 angle 的一个 bush 的设计。那主要的设计是在于你在过弯的时候，呃，这个地方必须要提供车身侧向的的支撑力。那如果是这种有角度的话，我比较容易提供车子侧向的支撑力。如果是垂直的话，会比较没有办法做到。所以通常如果假设用跟车身垂直没有夹角的这种，通常还要在。再加上其他的零件去补足这一块的不足，那这个这一次我们这样有个夹角设计就不需要。哦，好 ，OK， 那有一个叫耀耀的网友啊，他说这个这一次大家都知道这个叫 Model J。Model J 的扭力梁跟一般的扭力梁有什么差异？我们就直接讲好不好？这个扭力梁叫 Model J， 这边还用了矢量的导引技术，它到底特别在哪里 ？OK， he's asking、uh, the Model J torsion beam and the four patient spring. What's a special thing can be mentioned? Yeah. Okay. So let's start with the、uh, with the beam. So maybe I don't know if you can show it, but this beam in the center, the height is different than here at the at the uh, uh, end of the beam. Yeah. So、uh, the torsion beam is、uh, is not a constant profile, which means that、uh, where you don't need、uh, material because there's little stress, yeah, you don't、uh, you can make the beam、uh, smaller. Or less high, yeah. That's one、uh, element of the uh, J, uh, model J profile. The second element is the um, um, is the flanges. So、uh, we use、uh, flanges to increase the torsional rigidity of of the beam. So the result is for a certain torsional rigidity because it it, it is a torsion beam.、Uh, we can make it、uh, partially less material in the middle, so lighter. And with the flanges, you also uh, uh, have less、uh, material because the flanges add uh, torsional uh, uh, rigidity. So、uh, the Model J、uh, torsion beam is just a more efficient, more a more weight efficient、uh, for the same or for even better、uh, torsional rigidity. So that's one、uh, element. Okay. 扭力梁之所以扭力梁，它的重点就是要抗扭。那我们这个扭力梁设计大概有两个特点，你可以看到在这个中间的地方它比较低，这两边比较高。那主要就是我们在我们透过电脑模拟知道在。呃，整个扭曲的时候，哪些地方它的扭力应力是很低的？我们把这个地方的肉给刨掉，我可以做到很轻量化的效果。那另外一块是可以看到这边，这边有个 flange， 这边翘出来，这边里面这边也有一个。我们发现这这个相对一般的扭力梁没有，它是 U 型的，我们这是好像一个马蹄形。通过这个 flange， 我们透过电脑模拟，我们也知道这个整个抗扭能力是大幅提升。所以基本上这两个特点让这个扭力梁比起传统设计来的轻，然后抗扭强度还要多百分之十五到百分之二十。好，接下来就要进入比较。还有弹簧。哦，还有弹簧。也弹簧。Okay, so the second Ford patent is、uh, is the uh, uh, springs. So these springs, you you can hardly see it.、Uh, they have a, a different shape than a, than a normal straight uh, uh, spring. And what they do is, if they are positioned, and if、uh, the car is driving in a corner, these springs they can produce lateral forces. Yeah. So if Uh, the car corners, and、uh, the tire, which is on the outer end of the corner, there is a lateral counterforce to that.、Uh, in, 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 let's say, in the stabilizing direction. So that means this is a kind of a self-correcting、uh, behavior of of the、uh, twist beam, which means that it uh, uh, improves uh, stability. So with that. 
uh, because it has improved stability, we can still give it uh, a very agile uh, character and uh, still maintain uh, the stability. So these uh, patterns at uh, springs, they can really improve the overall uh, performance of the uh, uh, twist beam. 除了刚刚讲的 Model J 这个是福特专利设计的扭力梁以外，这个后面的弹簧也是福特专利的设计。那呃，我们叫做呃向量导引弹簧。那它它的功能主要是在过弯的时候，在你外侧轮一定会受到挤压。它有别于以往传统式的弹簧，只能够传统式的弹簧只能够提供你呃垂直的支撑力。那这种矢量导引弹簧，它在你受到挤压的时候，它可以给一个侧向力。换句话说，我们在过弯的时候，它可以给一个侧向力去抵抗我们过弯的。时候的的离心力，所以让车子达到比较稳定超，然后超加性能比较好的效果。这好，接下来就是比较比较尖锐一点的题目了。好，好不好？好，对，好，很多人呢很想要知道啊、哦，就是说台湾会不会有多连杆的版本？那为什么在台湾要选用扭力梁，没有像在国外一样用多连杆的选项 ？The question is, are we gonna introduce the SLA system to Taiwan market? Um, um, and why why don't we choose the SLA system like the other market is doing? Is that because of the cost consideration? Uh, I cannot comment on uh, future applications. Yeah, obviously, any future application uh, is is part of a decision uh, which will be made uh, in the future. So I I cannot comment on that. Yeah. 哦，他他没有办法说，呃，没有办法评论任何未来的的的决定，因为那都是比较牵扯到我们未来的策略的问题。但是我可以说的是说，嗯，我们最初衷的考虑不是为了成本，就是刚刚大概提到，就是说，啊、呃，我们要维持我们原来 focus 的。驾驭乐趣的风格，且要做到更好。那另外一块有很大的要求是，像台湾政府这对于油耗有很严格的要求，咖啡的要求，我们也要达到那个要求。所以基于我们，等一下，这个要求是什么要求？它是基于就是呃，所有福特所有品牌呃，在一年内卖出去的车子，所有的油耗不能超过一定的限制。超过会怎样？呃，超过的话就是罚钱。Yes。所以基于说呃，政府的。对油耗的要求，还有台湾实际呃市场的使用情况，我们最后决定这个是对我们最我们叫做最 balanced 的是一个一个选项。好，既然如此的话，我们就来看看网友啊对一些实实际的使用情况有一些问题，例如说扭力梁在坑洞的路上和独立悬吊相比，哪一种究竟是比较舒适的？ Okay. Um, he's trying to.、Uh, he's, the question is on the uneven、uh, road, like、uh, if you have some potholes. If you compare the torsion beam and the SLA system, which one give you better comfort? 然后两种不同悬吊，哪一种操控比较好 ？And among the two different、uh, suspension, right, torsion beam and SLA, which one is giving you better、um, uh, steering and handling performance?、Mm. Okay, let let me maybe start with the steering and handling. So uh, especially uh, the steering performance uh, is, is, is really uh, absolutely similar to,、uh, to the SLA.、Uh, so steering characteristics, they are uh, determined uh, not only by the front axle, but also by the rear axle. And、uh, we've made the characteristics like that, that we have very、uh, same steering、uh, performance. So our steering has to be very agile, so really responsive, has to be connected, has to be linear, And uh, uh, very uh, good modulation. So I'm really confident、uh, the torsion beam、uh, or our torsion beam、uh, delivers that as well. So handling is about stability. Yeah, stability. I just uh, mentioned uh, uh, with this uh, uh, patented uh, springs, we have introduced、uh, extra stability, and uh, that's uh, the reason why we are all meeting uh, our same uh, safety uh, targets for stability、uh, with the two、uh, suspensions. 我们先先讲就是呃超价超价的性能哦，那这个这个是它的强项。那我们很有信心可以说，我们福我们的这个呃多呃拖移臂系统跟我们的多连杆系统，其实开起来是是非常的差不多的。那我们维持我们一贯以来有的福特的的超价的的风格哦，特别是我们刚刚讲到的这个。这个专利弹簧，它给我一个侧向力，然后还有我们加强了我们这个拖移臂的刚性，所以我们在所有的超架性能上都满足我们的工程规范。
So another comfort uh, question. So um, there are different types of comfort. There's primary comfort with large inputs, and then uh, secondary comfort with uh, small, uh, smaller inputs. So the primary uh, comfort is mainly determined by uh, the springs and uh, let's say uh, a certain region of the shock uh, setting, and, we, and that is uh, is very similar. Um, for the secondary uh, ride, which is uh, the smaller, uh, the smaller inputs, uh, we used, uh, particularly on this twist beam, the benefit of the large uh, twist beam bush. So that's the bush uh, which you have here, and which is tuned uh, differently into a vertical direction as it is into lateral direction. So laterally, it is uh, quite stiff for good steering and handling, and uh, vertically, we have a lower stiffness for uh, ride uh, comfort. So any inputs, whether they are small uh, or bigger, uh, they are filtered uh, through the bush, and uh, uh, that that makes us believe we are uh, very comparable uh, to uh, any other independent uh, system. 在乘乘坐的舒适性上，我们工程术语分两个，一个叫做 primary comfort 跟 secondary comfort。comfort primary comfort 主要就是比如说我们在过一些大波浪的那个路况的时候，这个这个 comfort 主要的设定来自于来自于我们的弹簧。那至于刚刚提到，就是比如说坑洞啊、不平整路面，我们叫做 secondary comfort。那它的主要的调主要的调教是来自于来自于这个这个 bush。那反而我们这次的扭力量设计，这个 bush 很大。那这个 bush 它可以提供垂直跟侧向的力道。那特别是在震动方面，它是是有关于垂直。那在垂直这一块，我们这次调教也比较软。所以换句话说，你有些细碎的震动，会比较不容易传递到车内里面来。哦，那照这样听起来，好，我自己来帮大家发问哦。照这样听起来的话，扭力量似乎是可以完全取代，呃，独立悬吊在这个车型上面啦。那包含了国外，我也想请问一下，目前贩售的比例啊，究、呃、竟在欧洲贩售的时候，大家是比较青睐扭力量的版本，还是独立悬吊的版本？又或者是未来，呃，未来的改款或者是未来的规划是以？扭力量居多，还是说未来还是要大大的发展独立悬吊在 Focus 上面 ？Okay,、uh, on this segment, it sounds like the torsion beam can completely、uh, replace the SLA system. So the question is、uh, to understand the other market. For example, in Europe, are the customer preferring the torsion beam more than the SLA, or the other way around? And for the future, is Ford going to introduce more and more torsion beams? Is that the strategy?、Um, Maybe first start with the、uh, European market. So、uh, one one aspect on the European market is that we have、uh, different body styles. So we have、uh, in Europe as well、uh, the wagon body style,、uh, which is not available here in、uh, in Taiwan.、Uh, that wagon、uh, body style has、uh, different requirements.、Uh, there, for example, the 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 boot space is、uh, very important, and、uh, we could achieve a very wide、uh, boot space. Uh, only with、uh, an independent rear suspension, which we modified and put、uh, the dampers more outward. So that is one of the reasons why、uh, some variants have uh, uh, an independent rear suspension. And for that variant, let's say the、um, uh, the total balance、uh, was better for、uh, an independent uh, uh, rear suspension.、Um, Part of the question was also on on the segment, and yes, indeed,、uh, the C car segment is a segment where、uh, the twist beam can、uh, can still work.、Uh, if you go uh, into uh, heavier uh, applications and uh, uh, higher center of gravity, then the application becomes、uh, more more difficult. So this is、uh, really one of the segments where、uh, this is uh, uh, perfectly uh, possible. 呃、yeah, uh, ，在在福特在欧洲市场，因为他们其实车型比我们还多很多。他刚刚讲，我们还有 Wagon 在那里。像 Wagon 的话，我们的选择就是多连杆式的设计，因为它的车身也,也比较宽，也比较长。哦，有些几何形状的要求，我们没有办法采用这个多连杆设计。但是是的，在这个 C 级距的车子，我们呃这个多连杆式的悬吊看起来，呃不,不对不起，我们这个呃拖曳臂式的悬吊确实是可以在这个级距呃。Working perfectly, very well. Okay, 那那他刚刚讲到欧洲人喜好哪一种呢？啊、uh, ，The question, uh, do European people mostly prefer the torsion beam or the、uh, SLA system currently on the focus? Well, 
I must admit that uh, uh, obviously we get feedback uh, from, from a couple of sources. So one source is uh, the press, obviously. They are telling directly what they think about it. And the other source is the customer. So let me start with the customer. So the customer is not giving any more uh, what we call things gone wrong, eh, TGWs. They are not complaining uh, more about uh, uh, the uh, twist beam suspension than the independent uh, suspension. And then secondly, uh, you would have uh, the press feedback and uh, we must recognize that the press feedback in Europe is, is very positive. So they, uh, the overall perception I think is that uh, uh, the twist beam is, uh, is uh, really as good as the uh, third generation uh, focus and we're really getting uh, credit for that and we are also uh, winning comparison tests against uh, competition including competition with uh, independent rear suspension. Yeah, 回答这个问题，我们在福特欧洲有有两个管道知道客户的客户需求。我们第一个有呃市场调查，直接对客人；那另外一个是从媒体的反馈。那从呃对客人的市场调查来讲，我们叫 TGW Things Gone Wrong。你有多少人觉得这个不好？那我们没有得到任何的，没有得到说不好的这种客户的直接反馈。那另外一块从媒体媒体方面也给予我们很正面的评价。好 ，OK。那关于呃，有一个很重要的问题啊，啊在这边先跟大家讲啊，目前线上快要九百人，如果你想要问什么问题的话，尽量问，我会帮大家整理成一个比较具体性的问题来发问哈。然后另外呢，很多网友就会说，其实它是可以开得出来独立悬吊跟扭力梁的差别，他觉得怎么样 ？Some people on the line say they can feel the difference between the torsion beam and SLA. How do you think? Well,、uh, obviously,、um, it's A fair comparison between a torsion beam and an SLA can only be done on the same vehicle, which is tuned、uh, to the same uh, um, uh, performance. Yeah. So if you give it a different character, you will feel the different character. So we、uh, were able. We we have been.、Um, we have variants where we have、uh, both、uh, suspensions, and、uh, tuned to the same uh, uh, DNA or the same character. And those vehicles have been driven by numerous people, and、uh, I can tell you, people were very often wrong、uh, when they told uh, that uh, they could feel the suspension. So I'm really convinced that you can feel differences in character, but if tuned to the same character, I am very difficult、uh, to to feel the difference between the two suspensions. 呃，我们虽然有两种、两种、两种底盘，那我们调教的基本原则是，我们会让它的风格是一致的，或者是我们讲 DNA 是一致的。那在我们的经验，我们很有信心，这里这两款的的的的调教是一致的。你如果要能够感觉到它的差异，我们认为是非常非常细微。所以它它可以分得出来吗 ？Can you tell the difference yourself? Uh, yes. Uh. Typically,、uh, we do, but、uh, you would、uh, you would be outside of the normal customer driving uh, uh, range, and that does not include the stability uh, driving. Uh, but uh, maybe through some special tricks,、uh, you could uh, you could uh, uh, feel the difference. But once again, I, I, I would、uh, myself. Uh, if I go out uh, on uh, a public road and I can do different kind of maneuvers, I would.、Uh, Not put any money on myself、uh, to be sure that、uh, that it's the one or the other、uh, suspension. Uh, he said he can, 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 对扭力梁这件事情非常有兴趣哦。还有人问到说，扭力梁既然这么厉害的话，为什么不全球统一直接用扭力梁就好 ？Sounds like a torsion beam. Our 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 torsion beam sounds like a king. Very very good. Why don't we apply to all the four global vehicles? 在 focus. Oh, oh, so the focus. Why why don't we apply this torsion beam to all focus in the world? Well, Focus family is is more than just the variants you see here. I gave the example of the wagons, which is they have a different requirements. There are other variants of Focuses, and also with other different powertrains, weight classes, raised variants, and so on. So, and obviously, we or the team looked at all of these variants and made decisions about the best possible. Rear suspension, 
given all the boundary conditions for that local application. Uh, that's. Yeah,我们全球的focus的车种 所以未来,也有人问到说未来有没有可能在台湾看到有独立悬吊的款式? So in the future, is, are we going to see SLA system in Taiwan? 我先说这个一定很关枪的回答,相信我 Well, once again, I can't comment on future applications。你关于未来怎么策划,怎么安排,它是没有办法回答,因为一个 yeah. <笑> And I'm probably also not the best person since uh, I am uh, asked to technically uh, uh, develop uh, the suspension uh, within the given uh, boundary conditions. Yeah.这样呢？呃，因为我们我们都是工程的，其实两款设计在我们都是都是现有的。那关键是我们的市场部，他们会持续关注看我们现在市场的反馈。如果说客户真的有需求，对我们导入是不会有问题。现在客户看起来似乎是有需求啦但是会不会买是另外一件事你怎么看这件事情这个我可能也不好讲因为工程上都是有的那关键就是说有没有市场那市场的反馈需求是什么我讲就是我们会买车的客人这个我会回到我们
we can use the torsion beam, in what condition we can decide to use the SLA. Uh, not sure I really understood what you mean with in what condition. Yeah, they, they, quite honestly, the people are looking for, uh, are we looking for SLA system on the vehicle, but now we are choosing the torsion beam. So the question to us is to understand, okay, for a motor company, under which condition you allow the vehicle to have a SLA? Well, there are different parameters that uh, define the choice of, uh, of a suspension. Uh, like mentioned, uh, weight was very important for focus. That's why uh, it, it is clearly in favor of a twist beam. Uh, there are some other uh, elements which you have to consider. If the vehicle uh, where you de design the suspension for uh, is, uh, has different characteristics, and characteristics can be much higher center of gravity, much higher payload, and so on, then the equation might, uh, might change uh, uh, into favor of another uh, suspension. Yeah. So, um, it's, it's uh, the sum of all these uh, characteristics that you have to take into consideration and then make the best choice. It's kind of an optimization uh, uh, topic, uh, which, you, which you would have to do. Yeah, 这样的一个选择它是要罚款的 so people are worried about the three-cylinder engine and the A-speed transmission they are worried about the durability of the, these two, these two, uh, two stuff. Do you have any comment? Well, uh, the durability standards haven't changed. Uh, so, so uh, the new engine uh, is, uh, or the new engine family, has been tested uh, up to the same durability standards with success uh, as as the previous uh, generation, uh, as well as the uh, the new automatic uh, transmission. And uh, uh, obviously, one, one other element, uh, this, this uh, family of, of engine uh, is, is being used in other Ford applications as well. So uh, it is on the market uh, uh, a little bit longer already. And so uh, I think it has proven there its uh, durability uh, status already. Uh, 从以前到现在这个三缸的引擎都没有改变过那如果讲说这个三缸引擎其实在好几年以前像我们的Fiesta一点零的那个就是三缸那一样的就是在变速箱方面虽然八十五是第一次导入但是我们在测试的耐久规
，我们没有办法做比较，它是不是有开过两种，一个是独立悬吊，一个是扭力梁，它有没有比较过？最大的差别是什么？那它怎么建议台湾的消费者 ？OK， 嗯、um, ，The many people are asking. They, I just want the SLA. I want the SLA. However, in Taiwan, there is no SLA available anywhere. So the question for you is: Do you do you have experience comparing these two suspension system? And what's your your take out? And what's your recommendation to the Taiwanese customers if they do want the SLA? Yeah, I would only have one recommendation. That's that's to drive the new focus. Yeah. So uh, maybe once again, so we don't consider this to be a normal twist beam as it used to be. Yeah? So this is a very much improved uh, twist beam, and uh, I would uh, I would suggest to everybody drive the car and see what kind of complaints you would have on the driving, and I would be honestly surprised if there would be major complaints uh, and if people. Even could tell、uh, differences because, as I said before, I think differences are mainly into a, a different character. But we tuned the focus character into this twist beam, and I can't、uh, feel the difference.、Uh. Yeah, uh, our recommendation is that we hope everyone will come to drive our car. Although we don't have such a system called the Nuclear Bridge, but this is not a normal Nuclear Bridge. We hope you will come to drive our car. Now, after driving, if you really feel the difference, we will be a little surprised. Even if there is, it is very small. Okay, good. Thank you very much. Most of the people who are asking about this are about the Nuclear Bridge. Yes, we have a lot of people who are asking about the Nuclear Bridge. Yes, we have a lot of people who are asking about the Nuclear Bridge. Yes, we have a lot of people who are asking about the Nuclear Bridge. Yes, we have a lot of people who are asking about the Nuclear Bridge. 其实你可以开两个产线，对不对？我要选配，你就给我多连杆；我不要，你就扭力梁给我就好。有这么简单吗？<笑>呃，不，设计都是有的。其实我们导入是很是是不难的。難的那对，那这个的话，我想我可以选，当然可以选。那所以这个我还是会回到我们的那个市场部。哦，如果真的市场上有需求，我们会去可以考量看怎么样让它在什么时机点，怎么让它什么，这个是可以讨论的。也是有机会吗？对，我们没有没有不能选。那可以选，但是重点还是回到刚刚处长讲的，就是让大家实际的去试驾过之后，然后再反馈，你觉得需要不需要？如果选的话，其实讲白了，多连杆的零件组件比这个都还要来得多，所以成本一定是会再加上去，那就要看再加多少，大家觉得有没有必要？是不是大家都可以开得到那么极限，或者是怎样的？这个都有讨论的空间。好，然后之后呢，呃 w a g o n 也有可能会。在考虑啊，还在考虑啊，不不，我也没有讲，我是说我不能帮他们发言，但他们有在考虑，但是还是要考虑一下，这一次大家对 Focus 的这些反应，觉得是怎么样？然后另外呢，呃，在我的频道上面，四门的已经试驾完了，大家有兴趣的话可以去看一看。另外，另另外五门，来，那你来，来，来，你过来啊，来，小小那个，来，你讲。另外广告一下，车水马龙网也不错。对，<笑>好，今天我们在力宝乐园哦，举办了很多的活动啊。今天主要是试驾五门款，大家都还没有看过。今天会比较 focus 在赛道上面，之后在三月中的时候也会帮大家试驾五门的款式，也会在频道上上架跟大家分享。好，另外问他最后一个问题，有网友说他是不是觉得台湾人很难搞？<笑> Yeah, the last question for you. Someone is asking, "Do you feel Taiwanese people are very difficult to manage?" <laughs> <laughs> well, I, uh, I must say I got the same question、uh, maybe many, many times、uh, today. So、uh, I don't think、uh, you're difficult.、Uh, I think you're.、Uh, uh, you, yeah, you have a certain idea, and you really, really want to be um, um, convinced. Uh, that、uh, that idea is 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 not true or or true, yeah. So, yeah. 他的经验，呃，我他他的经验，他从世界各地有接受类似的问题，其实很多。哦，那他不认为台湾的顾客特别难搞。哦，他他的感觉是，台湾的顾客很有求知的欲望，一直想要达到一个答案，能够说服自己的。我觉得这个是非常好的。<笑>好，另外。我看到第二多的问题就是，很多网友在问说，这个 T 恤到底在哪里可以买得到？ Where to get the hoodie？ 呃，可以可以抽奖几份给观众朋友吗？可以吗？我帮大家争争取一下，可以吗？几份几份？可可以吗？我不知道大家想要几份，我问一下大家好不好？我们我们量力而为，真的吗？大家大家要买帽 T 耶，可以买得到吗？哦，买买不到，这是非卖品。他他们说很好看，不要抽了，直接开卖。很多人都要哎、欸
。好，我们抽抽十件好不好？可以吗？五件，好，五件，五件，因为限量的，就是应该是为了活动做出来，所以其实没了就没了。然后呢，因为这个衣服有 size 的关系，所以我们就随机出货好不好？我们也是现在争取的，我都逼把他们逼到那个屁股都烧火了，所以也不要再。<笑>不要再为难他，我们就五份。之后呢，我们就 FB 办活动送给大家，好不好？这个帽 T 真的是蛮好看，不错。So、OK， 大家都说加一。<笑>好 ，OK， 那今天的直播就到此结束了，谢谢各位，谢谢两位，谢谢两位。那其他我们就在影片见啦。我是医生，我们下次见，拜拜。Thank you，Thank 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 you，Thank